exactly how big does a land-based vehicle need to be to qualify for the Guinness Book of World Records as largest in the world? How about 315 feet tall, 740 feet long, and weighing over 31 million pounds? The Bagger 293 is a giant bucket wheel excavator built in Germany in 1995. It requires a crew of five to operate and can move over 8, 5 million cubic feet of earth per day. To put that in perspective, that is the equivalent of digging a hole the length of a football field and over 80 feet deep in a day. Prelude FLNG is the world's largest floating natural gas platform. Constructed of more than 260,000 tons of steel and measuring 488 meters in length and 74 meters wide. It was built by Royal Dutch Shell, Kogas and Inpex in 2013 and is thought to have cost around $12.6 billion. It's in use around 120 miles off the coast of Australia, where it drills for gas and will do so for at least a couple of decades. This monster machine is impressive when you compare it with other man-made objects on the ocean. For example, it displaces five times more water than the Nimitz-class aircraft carriers, the second largest warships in the world. Latorno L2350 is another monster machine. This is, according to the Guinness World Records, the biggest earth mover ever built. It can lift earth to incredible heights and has a load capacity of around 80 tons. That's something like 30 cars. Its tires are gargantuan, standing at 13 feet tall and 5 feet wide. Its bucket is also massive, capable of holding the same as five standard dump trucks. All this weight is powered by a 16-cylinder 65-liter diesel engine that puts out around 2,300 horsepower. That power needs some serious fueling too. The tank on this beast holds nearly 4,000 liters of diesel. It's massive in every possible way. We've seen massive vehicles that can dig in huge excavators. What about vehicles big enough to shift all that earth? This is the world's largest haul truck. An ultra-class truck that needs eight wheels to move and can carry 450 metric tons. It's driven by two MTU 65-liter 16-cylinder diesel engines but due to its weight, it only has a max speed of 40 miles per hour. Still an impressive piece of machinery. The Komatsu D575A Superdozer is the largest bulldozer on the planet and has been in production since 1991. This monster digger stands at 16 feet tall, 38 feet long and 24 feet wide. 
It boasts a 12-cylinder turbocharged diesel engine putting out 1,150 horsepower and is capable of shifting 96 cubic meters of material in a single pass. Certainly one impressive earth-moving machine. Not impressed by the list so far. How about a massive bridge? The F-60, also known as Veb Tachraf, is the largest movable technical industrial machine in the world. Essentially, it is an enormous conveyor belt that is used to transport overburden during coal mining. The F-60 is an impressive structure and also the longest man-made vehicle ever made. It's also one of the heaviest, weighing in at 13,600 metric tons. There are five of these massive overburdened bridges in existence, and some are still in use today. It's the world's largest tunnel boring machine that was made in Japan, but used in Seattle to take part in the Alaskan Way Viaduct Replacement Tunnel Project. The tunnel was started in 2013 and set to craft a tunnel 2,830 meters long. Production had to stop various times over the years, due to different problems including a sinkhole opening up in the machine's path. It's thought the project has cost a staggering $224 million. The world's largest scaled composites model 351 Stratolaunch aircraft, better known as the Stratolaunch Rock, has made another, already the ninth test flight, during which it set several records. The flight lasted six hours and Stratolaunch Rock flew for the first time outside the Mojave Desert, California. During the flight, tests were carried out of the Stratolaunch Talon a supersonic aircraft prototype which, in turn, is a transitional stage for the creation of a full-fledged Talon Z space shuttle, which will be able to deliver cargo and passengers to Earth orbit. The predicted speed of the Talon A, which will be launched from the Stratolaunch rock, is Mach 5 minus 7, that is, 6,108, 600 kilometers per hour. Slapier is a next-gen semi-submersible crane vessel capable of hoisting 2 times 10,000 tons. That is about 20,000 medium-sized cars, 220 meters in length and 102 meters in width, which makes it the largest and strongest crane vessel in the world. The first crane vessel to run on dual fuel, low-sulfur marine gas oil, and liquefied natural gas for areas with different environmental requirements. This massive lift capacity makes the vessel perfect for installation or decommissioning of offshore facilities, including installing or removing jackets, topsides, and other equipment. It can work in shallow water and ultra-deep water, installing all types of structures, moorings, and foundations deep under the ocean surface.
The CAT 6040 is a powerful and durable digger designed to power through the toughest materials while withstanding the harshest digging conditions day in day out. This CAT mining shovel features powerful twin C32 engines and an efficient hydraulic system to generate fast cycle times and deliver peak productivity of up to 4,000 tons per hour. Moreover, with its legacy of durability and reliability through robust structures and heavy castings, the CAT 6040 regularly exceeds its target design life of 60,000 hours in the field. This is the ship of many names. It was originally known as the Seawise Giant, then Happy Giant, Knock Nevis and Mont. But one thing has stayed the same, it is the longest ship ever built despite being scrapped in 2010. It was constructed in 1979 and had an interesting life that included being temporarily sunk during the Iran-Iraq War. The ship is also thought to be the largest and heaviest ship of any kind. It had a displacement of 657,019 tons and was so large, it couldn't navigate the English Channel, the Suez Canal or the Panama Canal. To give you a size perspective, the Seawise Giant was longer than the Empire State Building is tall, 